Welcome to Metro City's wonderful new amusement park. I hereby declare it officially open to the public. The perfect diversion. I get to visit a brand new amusement park with my favorite niece. Yeah, Uncle Gadget, but these crowds could cause problems. No problem. We have my gadget mobile, Penny. It's always on duty. What would you like to do first? Well, I've always wanted one of those panda bears. Simple, Penny. One panda bear coming right up. How many of those ducks do I have to hit? You have gotta hit three of them. Only three, eh? I should warn you that good marksmanship is my business. Now I hold my breath and squeeze. This guy thinks he's a pretty good shot, don't he? He's not a guy. He's my uncle. <laughs> Too bad, you missed the third duck. Too bad. I thought I saw the whites of its little eyes. Sorry about that, Penny. Pardon me, sir. Huh? Oh, look, Penny, a real clown. No. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, I... Chief, what a clever disguise. Ha, <laughs> 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 Huh? <laughs> I just got this report from our intelligence unit. Mad agents have hidden a bomb in the amusement park. They're going to hold the city for ransom. The bomb is set to go off in half an hour. This message will self-destruct. Wowzers, Chief! This is terrible! <laughs> if we don't deliver ten million dollars in half an hour, this whole place is gonna blow. Maybe we should evacuate the park. Not enough time. Gadget. You've got to find that bomb. It's set to explode at noon. That's in 25 minutes. Good luck, Gadget. Oh, no! Penny, I'm afraid you and Brain will have to go home. It turns out I'm on a very dangerous mission here. Be careful, Uncle Gadget. I think we can use Inspector Gadget's presence to our advantage. <laughs> Let him win our special bear. <laughs> hey, buddy, wait a minute. I... Tell you what, mister, you hit two ducks. So here's a little bear for you. Thanks. I was hoping to win one of those larger ones for my niece. But I really don't have time. I don't like the looks of this brain. We'd better keep an eye on Uncle Gadget. I've got to find that bomb. <laughs> Wowzers. That guy must be the mad bomber. Stop! Stop in the name of the law! Oh! Hulk, you hooligan! There's no hope of escape! What a lovely family you have, Mr. Gator. Nice family. Nice, Mr. Gator. Oh. Mm. What an unexpected surprise. Gadget has trapped himself. <laughs>
Okay, Brain. I'm going to the far end of the grounds and work my way back to here. We only have 20 minutes to find the bomb before it destroys the amusement park. Watch Uncle Gadget and let me know if he spots anything. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Do you happen to have the correct time? Wowzers! Not a moment to lose. I must find that bomb. Are you ready? Ready, Dr. Claw? Oh, pardon me. You're looking for trouble, bud girl. Uh, excuse me. That's the man who tried to cotton candy me. Stop! Sniffer, I'd better hurry. That bomb is set to go off in 15 minutes. Still no sign of that bomb. We're going to have to hand over that ransom. Ten million dollars in unmarked bills. It's a sad day for Metro City. We still have 13 minutes. Chief Quimby assures me he's got his best man on the job. Less than 13 minutes before that mad bomb goes off, and the place is crawling with mad agents. Ooh. Mm. I love happy endings, and this one's going to end with a bang and 10 million dollars. <laughs> That's one million, two million, three million. <laughs> Calling all mad agents. Keep Gadget busy. Make sure Gadget doesn't...
doesn't discover the <laughs> bomb. Bomb? Did you say bomb? Nosy. know where the bomb is hidden. Go, go, Gadget Arm! So, you thought you could get away? Let go, you, you, you mad agent! Ouch! Go, go, Gadget Brella! That was quite a stunt! Say, you're the star of the Captain Outrageous show! Oh, my. Captain hero. Outrageous! Go, go, Gadget Copper! <laughs> Terribly sorry! Ooh. I'm on an important mission. Time is of the essence. It's great to be appreciated, even if they don't know who I really am. Excuse me, sir. Is this yours? Why, my panda bear. I almost lost it. Thank you very much. <laughs> Wait a second. You're the mad bomber. Stop that little old woman! She's not a woman! And she's not old. I'm almost back where I began, and still not a trace of the explosives. Oh, and only ten minutes left! Oh, dear! Keep going. I'll take care of Gadget. Excuse me, are you looking for a suspicious looking man? Yes, and it's very urgent that I speak with him. He went this way, up aboard. <laughs> Sir? Happy trails! <laughs> Book, there are traces of dynamite in the vicinity. Hmm. What can I do for... Huh? Hey, ain't you the little girl that was... That's right. Where's the panda bear that was there? <laughs> Seems to me that some old guy won it. Let's see... Uh... I think it was your uncle. Oh, no. Hey, wait a minute. Hey! Huh? Uh-oh. <sighs> the bomb must be an Uncle Gadget's panda bear. I have to find him. Gotta switch to search mode. Yo! There he is. With the panda. Uncle Gadget, I'm coming! Uncle Gadget! Brain! Oh no! Yikes! We've only a few minutes left, and there's no word from Quimby. 
What are we going to do? Let's contact him. Maybe he has some news. <laughs> Pretty soon, Metro City will vanish. <laughs> That's mad power. Got to do something. I know. Hey, I think it's going kind of slow. I'll fix that. Hey, we better get out of here before it blows. See that mad Asian around here? Time's running out, Quimby. What are we going to do? Don't worry, Mayor. I've got my best man on the job. To be sure, I'll check to see how he's doing. was in the panda. Well, Chief, I, uh... Never mind. The mayor will want to congratulate you. That fool! <laughs> you beat me this time, but I'll get you next time! Inspector Gadget, on behalf of this city, I want to thank you for saving the amusement park. Tell us how you did it. I won't go into details, but let's just say it was as easy as throwing paper into a waste paper basket. Water safety is very important. Never stand up in a boat to wave. Always sit in the middle of the boat seat. Here's a lifesaver for each of us to wear. Good girl. 
But Uncle Gadget, even if I fall in, I can swim very well, and so can Brain. Even so, it's difficult to estimate how close the shore is sometimes. And if you do capsize, cling to your boat. It'll be easier for your rescuers to find you. And if you must bring a dog along, make sure he knows how to sit still. Right, Penny. 